What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Izzy. I am a content creator from Vancouver, Canada, but I am currently in Australia. I'm here for six weeks. Today, I just thought it would be kind of fun to do like a chatty little unboxing with you guys because I got all of this PR in in the last week. So I thought it would just be kind of fun to show you guys what I got. A lot of them are like some of my very favorite brands. Um, lots of Australian brands that I normally work with but since I'm here it's just that much easier so anyways I'm pretty much just gonna like dive right into it and we're gonna chat our way through this thing and then I might try some of it on too we'll see okay so I thought I would just open everything beforehand to make like the actual opening easier and I'm literally sitting in a giant mess you can't even you can't even really see the floor I just have to give you a visual um yep this is typically what it looks like after an unboxing when there's this many packages and this many different pieces of clothing. So anyways, I thought I'd make my life easier by doing this. It actually made it a lot harder. <laughs> we'll get into the we'll get into the unboxing now. Okay, so the first package, which I'm not actually going to open for you guys because it is my dress. There's a sneak peek for you. It is my dress and bag and earrings for my engagement party, which is this weekend. So, and I'm doing a vlog for my, it'll be like wedding series part three of the engagement party. So you'll see the dress and all the outfit details there and everything, but I did try it on. It's really cute. And the bag is probably my favorite part. So I can't wait to show you. The only hint I'll give you is that it's from Revolve, which isn't much of a hint at all because they have like 900 white dresses on their website. So anyways, I'm really excited to try that on for you guys on the weekend. Okay, let's kick things off with Motel Rocks. They are one of my favorite Aussie brands probably. They have just like the coolest like edgy but still like comfy cool pieces always like very on trend this first piece it's like quite stretchy like ribbed kind of cool pattern top with a collar kind of fun flared sleeves i feel like i'll wear it like one button done up and kind of like open really cute with like baggy jeans it's like the right what am i trying to say it's like the right weight of a top for the weather here in australia right now I came here just assuming that it would be as hot as the last two times I've been here, which was like both in the summer last time, and it's kind of like fall here right now, so I wasn't really anticipating. Like, don't get me wrong, it's not cold, like it's like 20 degrees, but it gets pretty chilly in like the afternoons and evenings. So anyways, I needed more like fall clothing because my entire wardrobe was essentially summer clothes. Next up, these are like the perfect baggy jeans. Well, in saying that, I have not tried them on yet, but they are, they look really cute on the website they look kind of short i'm interested to see if they're going to be long enough for me or not i guess i'll just have to wear them like quite low rise but they're like a nice wide leg fit so i'm definitely excited to try those on okay next this might be the top i'm the most excited about from motel it's like this little like it's kind of like waffly material and it's got a little like open front there's like three little open little bits so I think it'll be really cute. It'll look good with jeans. And it also looks really cute with mini skirts. I've seen a few girls style it on TikTok. Like a little black mini skirt and boots. I feel like that would be really cute. And then lastly, I got these cargo pants. I actually wanted them in like a more of like a brown like taupe color. But they sent blue because they were out of the taupe. Which is still like a really pretty color blue. They look super comfy. They've got like elastic. I can't think of words. English isn't coming to me today. But yeah, you can like tighten the bottoms. And then they have like a zipper at the front. They're also like fairly low rise fitting, but I'm super, super into cargo pants right now. And these look so comfy. Like they literally, they kind of remind me of scrubs, but like in a cool way. So I think they'll be like really, really comfy. I'm excited to wear them. Okay, next let's go into some hair care. This brand's called Monday Hair Care. It's really cute packaging. I haven't tried their products before, but I've heard really, really good things. Look how cute. The way that it's packaged is so cute. This is their moisture shampoo and conditioner for dry and damaged hair, which my hair has been feeling like more dry lately. So I'm really excited to try this. Paraben free, cruelty free. It's all the good stuff, you know? So I'm excited to try that. Okay, next is a big box. It's from Lack of Color, which is my favorite hat brand in the entire universe. Cute little note. This is from their their newest collection, 
which I forget what it's called, but I'll write it in the comments or in the description. I mean, when I do post this video, but this hat's so, so cute. It's got little cacti. I don't know if you can see little cacti and stars around it. It's very like fun and like desert vibes. I don't really have a lot of like cute cowboy hats like this, so this will be really cute and nice for, I keep saying the word cute. It'll be really nice to wear at the beach with swimsuits and stuff. It is still warm enough like on a good day here to go to the beach in a swimsuit, so that's how I'm planning to style this bad boy. Okay, next up will be Princess Polly. I got a bunch of stuff from there, so we'll just kind of go through it one piece at a time. And by the way, I have a discount code with Princess Polly. It is Izzy, just I did Y, and you get 20% off. Just realizing right now that my friend's shoe is literally in the corner here, and it was here the whole time. <laughs> just really feeds into my chaotic energy today. Anyways, um, the first piece from Princess Polly is this cute little like Def Leppard mini tee. I've been wearing mini tees like this so much. I just wear them with like cargo pants, jeans, kind of everything. They're like good little everyday shirts that you can just like throw on and you still look kind of chic and like you tried. So I've been like loving having these in my wardrobe. So that one will be really cute. This next piece is just a little mini skirt. It's actually not what I was expecting when I picked it out. It's like kind of like a waffly material. I thought it was just like stretchy black material but i'm sure it'll still look fine on and serve the same purpose i just needed like a good black mini skirt next because i was just saying that i needed more warm stuff i got this oversized sweatshirt it says palm springs on it it's really soft i feel like it'll be cute like doing like the little like crop tuck situation with like baggy jeans very into this literally so soft next because i literally don't have enough colors of this pant if you guys watched my denim haul like a couple months ago i like hauled hauled i like recapped like all of my favorite jeans and i have these lioness pants in three different colors other than these ones but i got them in this like dark denim color this is a size medium i didn't I, this is like I get a medium if I want like the really low rise like baggy fit so that's how these ones will fit but I also have a couple pairs in a size small for like still kind of a loose but like more fitted look so these are like those the dark denim color and then I got this maxi skirt which is so cute I love the print it's got like cool photos all over it it's actually like fairly thick too so I'll be able to wear it here like in the evening and not be like super cold. I really like this. And I think I'll wear it with this little top, which is also from Princess Polly. It's like a little like halter top. I think the colors will match really nicely. So that's super cute. Oh, and one more thing from Princess Polly is this set. It's kind of like cute, like textured material. So this is like a little micro skirt with a slit and it goes with this little like t-shirt top i think it'll be really cute together with like tall boots i'm really into it okay let's do storettes next i got this little hat it says newport beach 1984 usa on it i just thought it was like cute because i didn't i brought like one ball cap here and it's bright green so it'll be nice to have like even just if i wear this like to the gym or just like with other outfits and stuff i feel like this will be a good staple i think i'll wear it a lot and then next i got the exact set that I'm currently wearing but in blue because it's been like chillier I've been wanting to change into like sweatsuits at night and when I'm doing like admin through the work whether through the work whether <laughs> when I'm doing admin through the week I like to kind of work like wearing a sweatsuit at home I feel like in Vancouver like that's normally what I wear so like here I'm feeling that too but I didn't really bring a lot of sweatsuits like I brought this one that I'm wearing and then one with pants but it's it's a zip up jacket it's not like a crew neck so anyways that was a long explanation but i got the same one that i'm wearing in this blue color that's really cute so we'll definitely get a lot of wear out of that because it'll be like nice to wear through the day or in the evening when it gets a little chillier and then i got this set it's like a crop it's like a reworked blazer kind of vibe so this is like a cropped little blazer with one button and then the skirt is supposed to look like the rest of the blazer so it's got like the button here in the pockets and it's got like a cute little slit so i'm excited to 
try that on. I feel like it'll be really cute. And it's white too. I feel like I could wear it to something bridal. I have so many, like, I want to wear as many cute bridal dresses as possible throughout my, like, engagement and wedding and stuff. But this could even be cute for something, potentially, maybe too. I just have to throw more events so that I can wear more cute white outfits. Okay, next we have some pieces from House of CD. I love their stuff so much. The first piece is this skirt. It's honestly not the material that I was expecting. It's a lot like thicker, more like formal material, but I think it'll be really cute. So it's like a maxi skirt, but then it's got this really high slit and you, you wear it low waisted. So it should be really cute and like quite sexy. So I'm excited about that piece. And then I got this top, it's very sheer. So I think I'll just wear like a black bikini top under it probably. It comes with a matching skirt too, but they were sold out of the skirt so they weren't able to send it. But this shirt's really cute. It's got like wide sleeves with lace detailing on the ends. I think it's really cute. It would look good with like a, some kind of skirt too probably. And then last but not least, this is the piece that I'm the most excited about. It's like this super, oh my God, I can't. Just struggling today, you guys. It's like this really ruffly pink top. Even like the sleeves are ruffly. It's quite sheer. So there's this little like bralette that goes with it. That's so cute too. I'm so excited to wear this. I have Chris's brother's fiance's bachelorette party to go to next weekend. And I think like all of us that are going are supposed to wear pink. So that will probably be the perfect opportunity to wear this for the first time. So excited for that. Okay, next up, I got some products from Bali Body. I'm working with them this month and these look awesome. I'm always looking for new sunscreens. So this is the hydrating body sunscreen. It's like water resistant and stuff, which is nice. And then this is a face and body sunscreen spray, which is honestly usually my favorite. I don't really love like cream sunscreens that are like really thick. So I'm excited for this one. And then this one's a face sunscreen as well. And it's got like a matte finish. It's super like non-greasy. So that will be really good. And they're all SPF 50, which is, that's good for your face. Okay, next I have a couple pieces from For Love and Lemons. When I first opened this, I thought that this was the entire dress. And I was like, wow, that's really short. Is that for a five-year-old? But what it is, is these are the straps. And then there's actually another piece that goes with it. It's like this little like bralette that has little straps at the back. So it's like super strappy. This goes here and then the straps go. I hope I'm explaining that properly. But anyways, it's gonna be really, really freaking cute. Everything from For Love and Lemons is cute though. Like you literally can't go wrong. I love their stuff so much. And then speaking of cute like bridal dresses and stuff, I literally almost died when I saw this one. It's so cute. It's like very low cut in the front and then it's got these really cute ruffly sleeves and like a slightly open back that ties and it's the skirt's really poofy because it's got like tulle underneath to make it like nice and poofy and fun so i'm definitely gonna wear this for like some kind of bridal event i'm not sure exactly which one yet because i already have my engagement dress sorted which you guys saw i have my engagement photo dress sorted i have my wedding dress sorted obviously i have my rehearsal dinner dress i have i can maybe wear this as one of the bachelorette ones or if i end up having a bridal shower which i'm not 100 percent set on yet then maybe i'll wear that as well but we shall see okay i'm pretty sure that was all of it. I've completely destroyed my friend Courtney's living room, so I need to go clean all this up now. I'm gonna run out of time to try things on, but I'm gonna be styling most of it on my Instagram, whether it's like on stories or on my feed. So make sure you're following me over on Instagram so you don't miss any of the posts in these cute ass outfits. If you have any questions about sizing or anything, feel free to leave a comment below and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss my next episode of my wedding series or any other fun videos that I have coming up. I'm vlogging lots while I'm here in Australia, so there's lots of fun footage, fun Australia facts, adventures, that kind of thing. So don't miss out. Subscribe. Till next time, you guys.